turn this setting on if youtube is not recommending your videos and you're getting less views what up guys so if youtube is not recommending your videos or you're getting small views on your channel there is this setting in our youtube studio that a lot of small creators are not aware of and that is what i want to show you guys in this video okay so i hope you watch this video to the end because you're going to learn a lot and if you're new to my channel feel free to hit that subscribe button and give this video a like all right so let's get to it okay guys let's get to it so i'll be using my computer to do it so let me first of all show you guys what my channel looks like so let's go to view channel so you see it's a random videos ai this is about CapCut, CapCut, video editing CapCut. this is a vlog this is about youtube so they are randomly placed okay i'm showing you guys this because at the end of the tutorial you're going to see how my youtube home page is going to look like it's going to be different so let's go and do the settings properly so that our videos will be recommended more or we'll have more views so click on your video icon here and go to youtube studio like i said before like I said before, you can do this with your phone too. So to go to your YouTube studio using your phone, just go on your browser and search for YouTube studio, open the website. If it's your first time, you'll be asked to sign in. So go to your studio like this and then scroll down here, go to customization and then go to home tab. Okay, so you see the first thing here says, show your channel home tab to highlight and showcase content for your audience. And this is off. If you have this off, please turn it on. When you turn this on, your YouTube homepage will be shown to audience, to people that you can easily start watching the video. So make sure this is turned on, not off. Now, come here, talk about uh, layout. Customize the layout of your channel homepage with up to 12 sections. Now, I'm going to show you guys how to do this one. So click here, click on add sections. Before we go to it for you, I'll explain this later. Click on add section. Now, your channel trailer, click on it. Now, channel trailer is supposed to be a video that can give a summary of what your channel looks like. If you want it to be your most uh, yeah, most trendy video, it's okay. Most trendy video doesn't really mean you need to have a lot of views. For example, if your average reach like 100 views and have a video of like 1,000, 9K views, that is your trendy video. That's your biggest video, okay? So I'm going to decide. I don't have a channel trailer video, but I want to put this one, how I made over $3,400 on WhatsApp. So I'm going to put this one here for my channel trailer. So channel trailer for people who haven't subscribed, they can watch this and then decide to subscribe or not. Now, go again to add section and click on spotlight for returning subscribers okay you have to look for another video it can be your popular the most popular video as well because channel, channel trailer can be a video describing your channel and what you do okay so like my popular video or any video i want i can just go to you have to understand here you're not going to see all your videos you can always search here okay but i want to click this one easy way to get your first 1000 subscribers to be featured video for returning subscribers right so let's just get done with all the section before i come with this for you here and explain something very very important this is where the key magic is so now click on add section now let's say you want to add a section of your most popular videos or your videos in order of popularity click on popular videos see you're going to have your videos in order of popularity so this is my most popular video second most popular video third most popular video okay and that is just how it goes so you're going to have my video or your videos in order of popularity so we're done with popular videos so let's go back to add section add section and then now i want to add another section maybe let's say i want it to be my short videos i can do that i want it to be my playlist because i have playlists that i've created so if you don't know how to create playlists check this video in the description i'll leave the link in the description you know how to play if you don't know how to create video playlists i'll leave a link in the description you can go watch that out. so click on single playlist so these are my playlists okay now i want to put i want to arrange my video in all of playlists so i can say cap cut I'll put it here and i can keep adding i add as many playlists that I, I want so my ai playlist i can put that here and go back again go to playlist single playlist i don't want to put multiple playlists that's up to you i go to youtube tips you can add that sections i go to playlist and i can add whatsapp tips okay add section again i go to playlist Single playlist, I'm doing this with single playlist. I've my vlogs and I can go. So I have a lot of playlists. So you can use them to arrange a home screen. So let me say I go to my short videos. Then I can also do my, I've done AI playlist already. So you see what we've done. So we've done all, we have all our videos arranged under popularity, you know, the playlist, CapCut playlist, there is AI playlist. I think I have an InShot playlist. I'll just add it as well yeah i do have an intro playlist so this is it so now this is how you get it done so you can keep doing that add your playlist accordingly if you want if you want multiple playlists you just have to come here and 
you know, click on multiple playlists, put you combine them and add them there. But I like mine to be like that. Anyway, so let's go now to for you. Okay. Let's click on set on more settings. Because for you talks about YouTube recommends fresh content based on your viewers' interest. This is only visible to your viewers when you have enough content. But well, let me show you guys here. Click on more more settings. You're going to see this. What to include in the for you section. Now the for you section will only be visible to viewers when you have enough content. One content type video short live streams now make sure all of these are on because some people all might be off like this okay turn all this on so if you have your videos they're going to be showing on your home page when someone visits your channel they can select any video and watch your short videos are going to be showing live streams are going to be showing now this one here is also very important recency now recency all content recommended so youtube even recommends that you always make sure your recency is at all content now, if you say recent content only, the content that are going to be recommended will be just content in the past 12 months. That's it. Content that you've posted in the past 12 months. Always make sure you are not here. Make sure your recency is at all content. And when you do that, you click on done. Make sure all of these are on too. On all of these guys. Click on done. Okay. Now, when you're done setting this up, you've added your section, your playlist, all of this here. Click on publish. Okay, now I showed you guys my channel homepage before, right? This is it. So random like this. You see that? Now let's go here and click on view channel. Now you see, I made about $3,400. This is our channel trailer right here. This channel, this video. This is it right here. Talking about how much money I made. Blah, blah, blah. So this is my for you. Okay, it's been recommended. You see, these are my popular videos. Everything has changed. So my channel has changed. My homepage has changed from this to this right here. You see popular videos. You can see them accordingly. CapCut playlist, AI playlist. So if someone visits my channel, they have the freedom to go through my videos easily and pick a video to watch. So my most popular video is 18,000 views. So they have that uh, freedom to just go through any of them. They want to watch videos for my, my AI videos. So they want to watch videos for my WhatsApp. My WhatsApp videos, videos about WhatsApp tips, they can just come here and watch them. See that? And you want to watch my vlogs, they will just come down here and watch them, just like that. So you can keep adding it. Now, for example, let's go back to the customization here. Now, have I added shorts? I think, yes, I did. I did add a shorts, right? This is short. So if you want to swap your sections, maybe say you want uh, your vlogs to come before. You see, because our first one is popular videos, and then we have a uh, CapCut playlist. So if, if I want my AI playlist to be above, the CapCut playlist like this, I will just track the AI section, put it on top like that. And then you have to click on publish. If not, you're wasting your time. Click on publish. Okay. So that's the trick. When you have your homepage arranged like this, the videos will be recommended, especially when you go to this for you and make sure you are recency that all content. All, all your content will be recommended, no matter how old your videos are. Once you are very frequent, when it comes to posting, you're posting frequently, any of your contents will be recommended to viewers or people who view similar content to yours. So you have to know that. So this is the trick. Make sure your, your channel trailer is set up for people who haven't subscribed and video for returning subscribers. Keep this or keep a video here for them. Then you can adjust your homepage by properly creating sections consisting of your popular videos, you know, particular playlists and put them the order that you want. If you want your YouTube tips to be up, just click and drag and it's going to be above the AI playlist. But make sure you publish. So if I go back and click on view channel, I'm going to, you're going to see now, this is my for you. I made over $3,400 teaching on WhatsApp in a period of three. Let me pause this. This is my for you. And then you're going to see our popular videos. Now YouTube tips will come up. And, and so people will just click on play all and just binge watch all of your videos. So that way, when they're watching one video here, the next is recommended. The next is recommended, which makes it easy for YouTube to keep recommending your videos. So if they're watching other people's, other people's videos on YouTube, your video will be easily recommended. If you're someone that goes live and you have your live videos, you want to show them on your homepage here, you just go back to add section, then you go to live stream, past live streams, and you put them there. You just click here and you're going to have your past live streams are going to show up. These are my live streams that I've had. Okay. It's as easy as that. And when you're done, click on publish. So that's how you do it, guys. Just go to your customization tab, your YouTube studio, go to home tab and set this properly. Please make sure you set this properly. All right. That's what I wanted to show you guys. Let's get back to me talking.
all right so if you watch the video to the end i want to say thank you and if you want to support this channel please give this video a thumbs up and if you're new to my channel hit that subscribe button and i'll see you in the next video bye bye